What's up, YouTube? Uh, this is Kaggle. If you haven't already checked out my channel, know who I am. Uh, I'm a dude who likes to play on the Xbox 360. Let's put it that way. Uh, anyway, I uh, got a request off my friend who is my first subscriber, and uh, he wanted me to get a kill streak this nuke. And uh, this is it. Believe it or not, those of you who know me. Anyway, um, I'm gonna start off with my loadout before I introduce myself. I'm um, going with the uh, ACR FMJ so that I can shoot people through walls because this is a uh, an FMJ map, believe it or not. The amount of things you can shoot through is ridiculous. Uh, secondary is an AA-12 with foregrip. Foregrip instead of extended mags purely because I prefer the switch out speed. You know, foregrip uh, decreases the time, makes it quick, and for a gun that powerful, it's pretty awesome. Um, rather than scavenger, stop and power, and sit rep pro. Uh, sit rep pro purely so that I can sound horn these kids that are going to come up on me and uh, it does come in handy. Uh, stop and powers, that's pretty, you know, you know the deal. Scavenger because uh, ACR, that chugs through bullets, man, real, real quick. And uh, so I can lay down my claim wars continuously. But um, that's the loadout done. So uh, I'm just going to do a quick introduction to those of you that haven't gone into my channel yet. Um, I'm Kaitical, aka Todd, uh, you can see me on Xbox Live most of the time, uh, I usually play Domination, Search, I usually play Hardcore Search, but I'm getting into Core Search again because, uh, when you come back off of Hardcore and you play Core Game Type, it's just, it's like you've been in a hyperbolic time chamber and you just seem to be that much better because you're so much more prepared. I'm not saying, you know, because Hardcore people can, but just... It makes you a better player, in, in, in my opinion, anyway. Um, so, that's that's why I play. Um, at the moment, I, uh, I I can't say I've been playing much with the Dazzle, because I just got it today. And that's why I was so happy, and my heart was racing. I, dear God. Anyway, um, yeah, the reason I run straight to this building from spawn is purely because uh, it's such an awesome place to camp. And I say camp because I'm not going to lie, I'm not going to go, yeah, it's uh, defensive gameplay, it's, uh, you know, I'm, I'm looking out for my team, because I'm not, I'm looking out for myself, because when going for a kill streak this nuke, who's going to be a team player? I mean, you're not going to, come on now, you're not going to go cap flags or go, you know, jump and take bullets for your teammates because you can, you know? So, um, I'm camping it up, I'm getting the kills in, and uh, the good thing about it is... Non-silence weapons attract people. Because this is team deathmatch, people uh, swarm to red dots on the radar like flies to crap. So, uh, that's the good thing about camping in the building. Now you see I have two claymores, one at the doorway and one at the uh, ladder. The one at the doorway kills people that come from any direction. They honestly won't see it unless they've been killed by it once. And even then, people still die by it, you know, two, three, four times. I mean, try it out sometime on this map. It's, it's a golden spot. I've wanted on the ladder purely because I don't want people sneaking up on me either way, so um, both plane was cover my ass and that way um, I don't have to worry about being snuck up on. But um, anyway, yeah, Syrup Pro, if you ever see me, like, uh, just look randomly and you had no idea what was going on, it's because I heard someone's footsteps in the distance. Now both my claim was got shot, and uh, that was because that dude that I just killed there, the second guy, he has Syrup on, so uh, he was shooting him. And I swear to God, if he had shot them and I was standing anywhere near that one on the ladder, that would have been it. But anyway, uh, as you can see, man, that's three people in about ten seconds. It's starting to get a bit heated. They're spawning near me and they know I'm up here. So um, I'm thinking about backing out pretty soon because they're gonna, they're really going to start hitting me now. There's dude, the martyrdom drops, and uh, it blows up the claymore, so I have to go and scavenge and put it down. You have to be careful, you have to listen out for things like that, because if I'd have left it, dude could have run straight up and killed me, so um, you got to keep on your toes. Now, I know I'm ticking them off when I just climb it over the wall and I get caught out and done, so uh, the dude comes in with the noob tube, shoots me from behind, I sponge it, like uh, Spongebob would, soak it up. And I decided to back out because once the new tubes come out, you know, danger close, one man army, you know they want you, they want your ass dead, basically. So uh, I hear the sniper light shot coming down the uh, alleyway because I had syrup throw on. 
So uh, that's that's where it comes in handy. That's exactly where it comes in handy. And uh, I keep going because I get tubed again at that car. And uh, I don't know. It's it's the sponge skills yet again. The car did not blow up, so I didn't die. Otherwise, I may have uh, had to buy a new TV because my uh, previous controller was lodged in it. Anyway, um, I'm keeping on the move because if I stay in the same place too long, they're going to track me down. So I'm circulating the outside of the map, trying to just pick off anyone I see and uh, play cautiously because I don't have anything like slight of hand or lightweight pro, so against the Russia, I'm not going to stand much of a chance. I uh, decided to come up to this building because I see the scramble on the UAV and I know there's at least one guy here, and there he is. So um, I think, you know what? I think I'm close to the nuke, so I'm just gonna like sit up here and wait for them to come to me because it's comfortable. There's scavenger packs, put one in the air. You know how it goes, man. Staircase, ladder, same as the other building. And I just wait, scavenger, and you know what? That was lucky because if he was looking the opposite way, he would have bum fucked me, and that would have been it. That would have been it. I, anyway, I get sniped. I knew that guy was there. If you play back, I press start on the map before I put the claymore down purely because I wanted to see where the red dot was, where he was sniping from, so I guess I had to kill him. But uh, anyway, that's my new kill streak. Cause, yeah. 30 for 2, final score. Um, that's pretty much it, guys. I'm going to be putting up a lot more gameplay, and it's going to be good. So uh, make sure to subscribe, check in, comment, anything you want to see, I'll put it up. So uh, it's been chaotic. I'll catch you guys later.